with your name on it. I'm the hero of this story. You're the fanboy wannabe. But if you really want to fight, <laughs> then please try and beat me. There are many things that I could do that you would never dare. I doubt you'd have the courage to take and claim senpai's underwear. Or tie a rival to a chair and make her wish she was never born. So drop the act and leave. I'm sure you're missing some freaky cable porn. <laughs> it's funny how the world is so enamored with your position that only a girl can fill your part for a story's true fruition. But you see, let me tell you about Rule 63. All characters have an opposite sex counterpart, like me. I'm the guy you don't want to mess with, so you better run and hide. I'll laugh my ass off as I slit your throat open and watch you die. It's not like Senpai will miss you since he'll just end up loving me. So I'll give you one verse to back away and beg me for mercy. You think that you're scary? Let me show you something frightening. You can't exist in a world filled with social justice lightning. A man can't be younger, he's a stalker, take him out! My sex gives me a pass, you're what they cry wolf about. <laughs> You think politics will stop me? Just take a look around. People crave my existence. Not as being wrong sound. It doesn't matter what we are. So your little verse just went to waste. So leave senpai to me. You sad pathetic waste of space. <laughs> you're funny for a dead man. And now you're wasting my time. I have to go make sure senpai's safe. I told you, asshole. He's mine. You won't take him from me. I'll kill you before you even get the chance. You really think so? I know so. All right, let's dance. <laughs> 